So we're preparing the can that we're going to use to cook the chickens. We're going to cut off the top and then put the chicken inside later. I told you today we're preparing eight chickens. We got some pork cooking here. Then Heckler's preparing the chickens. To, and Roland's over there is taking the feathers off. <laughs> then over here, we're going to prepare some corn. Corn. Yeah. Everyone's working hard up here taking off the feathers and cooking. I'm gonna go walk down here by the well. We're also doing the well today. We um, ordered some more supplies to get the roofing and then some wood for the poles. So hopefully we can get it at least most of the way finished today. Maayang, pag, abot, saakun, blag. Welcome to my blog. I'm with Nimwell and Raymond. We're gonna uh, take a couple trips and get some sand for the cement. Remember the house of the pig? Yeah, this is where we got the pig for the last fiesta. Motori. <laughs> okay, that's enough. Right. We're getting 12 sacks of sand and then two cements. Two bags. Two bags of cement and we'll mix that together. And 12 sacks of moon. And 12 <laughs> sacks of moon. Not sand. <laughs> Not sand. Yeah. We don't they don't sell sand here, only moon. Yeah. <laughs> Wanna load me up? Yo. Ah, oh, Alright. So this this hill is a little bit easier to walk. The other one that you've seen in the other hill is pretty straight down, but this one's not so bad. How are you doing today, Raymond? Woo! Is that Richie? When I ask it, Richie, what, how's she doing? She just goes, mmm. When I ask Raymond, he goes, woo! <laughs> all right, all left. All left. <laughs> I'm gonna sneak back up here. I'm supposed to help Richie make the macaroni salad, so I don't want to make her wait. And I'll go up there. I never made it before, so uh, I'm kind of interested to see how it's made. We got pans it. There's uh, what is that? Onion, yeah. pork, pork, pork. pork. Oh, garlic. garlic, garlic, and then the cabbage. And cabbage. All right. I had some pans it before. That's really good too. Hey, hey. <laughs> then here is the macaroni salad that Richie and I make. All right, before we start making the macaroni salad, I'm gonna try some of this pansit. That is a la Michelle okay. and a la Heidi. A la Michelle and a la Heidi. Mmm. La mit dote. Delicious, la mit. All right, so Mr. Pilsen is gonna be our camera guy today. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Okay, so this is my first time making this. I'm excited. This is called macaroni salad. salad. Yeah. Okay. So we have the ingredients are macaroni. macaroni. We have coconut, coconut and durian or condensed milk. Condensed milk and, and then Nestle cream. All-purpose cream. All cream. Okay. And then it's better if we have gulaman, but since we didn't. Needs to boil this one first and put in the wrap, so huh? we will not yeah. use gulaman, but it's okay. better to put gulaman. So. Yeah, so we're not going to use this today, but it's better, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so what goes first? Um, Did you wash your hands? Ready. It's okay because you will just mix this one. Not with our hands? Mm. Okay, so, so just put this in? Yeah. Okay, and then... Milk. All right. <laughs> What's funny? Oh, <laughs> very good. <laughs> <laughs> At least you can open. <laughs> All right, so we're finished. Now we're gonna put this in the refrigerator. Yeah. And then an hour later, it's good to eat. Thank you very much, Pilsum. Good guy. <laughs> All right, well, Uncle Pedro, he's gonna prepare the chicken. All right, so that's lemongrass we're sticking in. Garlic. 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 And then onion. Mumbai. Mumbai. We have peppers. Salt. We have some asin. 
with some soy sauce. Swan. All right, so those are two full chickens filled to the top of ingredients. So we found a big papaya we're going to stick in the salad and also a pineapple we're putting in there. <laughs> it's starting to thunder. I really hope it doesn't rain. It looks pretty cloudy. Richie and I are making the salad over here, and it's Mitchy and Kian, right? Okay, so Kian did a really good job with dancing the other day, and someone wanted to treat her 1,000 pesos. Wow. So that's for you. Keep dancing, okay? You do a really good job. All right, Kian's gonna give us an example. One, two, three, go. I love the way she makes me blush and makes me smile. Yes, yes sir. It gives me <laughs> All right, very good, very good. All right, here we go. We're doing it under here because I think it's gonna rain any minute. All right, so two in one can. Hopefully. <laughs> Bro, you okay? I got iodine and band-aids. Here, let's put that on right now. I got, I got band-aid. You should put a band-aid on though. Here. Francis just got cut. Wow. This is, I got iodine. This is for wounds. All right. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. All right. Thank you. No problem. Oh man, Francis got blood everywhere. All right, so Pedro's preparing the fire. We got two full chickens in there. We're gonna make a circle with coconuts around. So Uncle Pedro's gonna prepare this. The fire's starting. They have more chicken cooking over here. And I'm gonna go down there and check on the well. It looks like they got the post up, but rain is gonna come any minute, I think. We've been saying that for a while, but I think it's getting pretty dark over there. <laughs> Watch my step! <laughs> That's awesome. It's got the slant for the rain. That's awesome. <laughs> Putting some rocks in there for extra support. And this is why sometimes project takes a little bit longer in the Philippines because of the rain. It rains almost every day right now. So if it rains while this is still wet, it's just gonna wash everything away. But we're hoping it doesn't rain. All right, here comes the rain. Yeah, here comes the rain. So we will continue this tomorrow. Hopefully it's not raining tomorrow. So during the rainy season, that is one of the challenges here. It rains almost every day. So when you're doing projects like this outside, you just gotta rely on the weather. and. It's about to start pouring now, especially when you're working with concrete, it has to be dry. So we'll just continue on tomorrow. I think it's a good day's work. We got uh, the sides done and all we gotta do is put the 10 or the nine up and then uh, you'll be finished. Then taking baths, washing your clothes, you won't be so hot. Hey! Here comes the rain. <laughs> hi, hi. <laughs> What's up? Oh. Hey, hey. hey. <laughs> Campfire. Campfire, yeah. This reminds me of home. Almost every night in the summertime, we'd have a campfire outside like this in my front yard. So if anyone out there is looking for another way to cook without an oven, this is another perfect way. 
What's your favorite way to cook chicken? Adobo like that. Adobo? Yeah. Okay. This is my favorite so far. If you guys have seen the video when uh, Uncle Pedro cooked the bread, this is like the same concept. So all you really need is uh, a big tin can like this. You can cook bread, you can cook chicken, you can cook pretty much anything. This is a useful. Yeah, very <laughs> useful. <laughs> you guys got the bad seed over there. <laughs> oh, man. Make like a mosquito. Yeah. At least it's... At least it's one thing there's no mosquitoes right now because of the fire. What do you call this? Smoke. Smoke. Uh, smoke. What do you call it? Smoke. Smoke. Uh, asso. 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 Kind of like dog. Dog yeah. is asso. Tagalog. That is Tagalog, Tagalog speech. Okay, so Tagalog is asso dog. And then here is smoke asso. Same? Uh, asso. This asso is... Uh. <laughs> I can't see you. Where'd you go? <laughs> I'm here. Oh. That's a uh, Tagalog of dog. dog. Yeah, dog. Yeah. But for this is uh, Aso Bisaya. or Bisaya. Aso, Aso. smoke. Yeah. Okay. That's the Bisaya, Bisaya of ah, smoke. Aso. Okay. Why are you crying? I'm sad, man. I miss my mom. <laughs> you miss my mom. <laughs> okay. Uh, All right, I think I'm gonna go visit Richie. Uh, <laughs> because of thirst. Yeah. Uh, you guys are making me too sad. <laughs> Oh, it's raining pretty good. Everyone's taking shelter. All oh, they're doing... I think they're doing karaoke in here. <laughs> Perfect spots. <laughs> that should fill up in about two years. Oh, you should have waited till someone walked by. All right, so I'm gonna mix in the papaya and the pineapple. So just throw it in. Yeah. That is our cocktail. Yeah. <laughs> because we don't have cocktails, so we have fresh from well, the garden. Is, that's better anyway. I'd rather yeah. use this. I'm gonna taste it first. Ah. <laughs> So you have, if you have fresh fruit from the garden, then they can use, they can use um, mango. It's macaroni. How's it look? Oh, no. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh oi. Oi. Like this? Oh, you have brilliant mind. You wash your clothes using this one yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> it smells like underwear. <laughs> okay. Then ready. Put in the fridge. The fridge. Yeah. You can ask the kids to help you carry that. <laughs> Yummy. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Okay. Bye bye. Bye bye. See, see you, you later. in a half hour? Hour? Yeah, uh, half hour? Mm -hmm. Alright. So cool, that's ready to eat in a half hour. Yeah. I'm always I'm always hungry. Good book? I just picked up a bunch of these novels. The kids are reading these like crazy. They love these little pocket books. Another one hour, Dustin. Uh, Dustin. Another one hour. Dude. Another an hour? Yeah, one. Yeah. Another one hour. Okay. <laughs> every time I every time I ask him, he says one hour, and that was about a half hour ago. Uh, maybe three. <laughs> maybe three. <laughs> How's it looking there? Chicken adobo. Chicken adobo. All right, look at that. <laughs> The chicken's going fast. Thank you. <laughs> no problem. So while it's raining, and this is a perfect place to be. They're cooking some adobo in there. Poop sack of chicken. That's the poop sack. Yeah. All right, my favorite. So we got some more adobo cooking in here, and then the two chickens should be done pretty soon. So this is another way to cook it. It's chicken adobo. It's fried. Fried chicken. It's pretty much fried chicken. So that's chicken adobo, it's just fried chicken? Yes. Okay. Same. All right, it's a little dark, but the chicken is done. Wow. Wow. Yummy. 
It's your birthday, you get to pick the first piece. <laughs> we sing, happy birthday. Yeah. That is one good looking chicken. Yeah. Shake it. Good job, Uncle Pedro. Thank you very much, Justin. Thank you very much, amigo. Mm. You can smell that. The inside. Mm, that smells good. <laughs> First Aunt Vilma, it's her birthday. We should all say happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Rice. There's no meal without rice. Yeah. It's my bowl. It's my bowl. Gotta do the dishes. 
Thank you. So this is the macaroni salad that Richie and I made. Try to get a good bite. All right, it's all left. Mm. Yummy. Nice, nice, really good. One more. It's yummy. It's fresh papaya and fresh pineapple. The papaya you got from your grandma's, your Lola's, and the pineapple you got from your backyard, right? Yeah. You can't beat fresh. Mmm. That's delicious. Hey. And we have coconut. And what? Oh, coconut. Coconut's in there too, yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Yum, yum, yum. Delicious. <laughs>